Hey guys, my name is Simsy and welcome to episode 2 of season 6 of my FIFA 15 Real Madrid career mode. Guys, first things first, I just want to thank you guys for all the amount of support you've been giving me on my videos. Not just my Real Madrid one, just all my videos in general. They've been absolutely fantastic. So guys, we have two matches in today's episode, the first of which is against... Atletico in the La Liga, and then we have a match against Barcelona. We had the Super Cup of España in the previous episode. We did manage to win it quite comfortably in the end. So, guys, as you saw there, Sergio Aguero is going on a short-term loan to Schalke, and uh, Bo what's his name? Bobosa is going for uh, a loan to. FC Cologne. So two of my players going to the German league. Obviously because of the introduction of Javier Hernandez. He's a 91 overall and uh, Sergio Aguero is he's a little bit older and he's an 89. Javier Hernandez has been tearing it up in the La Liga and uh, I, I just feel like he's not getting his game time. I think we get a bit of a run. A bit, yeah, he might get go up in stats over at Schalke. But guys, we have a home match at the Santiago Bernabeu, and I'm hoping Mandron will be able to get his debut goal coming off the bench in today's episode. But guys, Lukaku on the ball gets his finesse off, and uh, quite luckily for the Atletico Madrid defender, um, managed to block it. There was a free kick there, Manuel Neuer saved quite comfortably, but we do manage to start off the scoring against Atletico Madrid just before the 26th minute. Javier Hernandez, the poacher, Puts it into the back of the net. A superb piece of play and a nice link up. It was a loft ball to Messi. And Messi passed it first time over to Javier. It was just a really nice um, worked goal. So, guys, let me know in the comment section down below. Would you like to see Season 7 of the Real Madrid career mode, even though it is still early days? Or would you like to see more United or, I don't know, another career mode of your choice? Now, Godin here scores an absolute fantastic goal to bring it back just before the 80th minute. <laughs> so I was very much under the pump here. Luis Suarez, 1-1 against Atletico, trying to beat them. Beats one with the Ronaldo chop and then gets contested. The tackle didn't come and he didn't want to tackle him too hard because it would have resulted in a penalty. But Luis Suarez, carving up the left-hand side of the field, manages to bring it back in the 90. And it was good to see Luis Suarez there actually playing like a winger, even though he is a striker. It was a really nice goal. Unfortunately, Mandron didn't get his debut goal. He didn't have many highlights in that match, but he did show some uh, prowess and promise in the Super Copa Espana. Uh, what I was um, what I was trying to mention before, guys, is let me know who do you think is going to win the um, the player of the season, and who do you think is going to win the Golden Boot, and do you think I'm going to win the Champions League and La Liga for the sixth time? I did win the Super Cup of Spain. That was one of my main one of my three main objectives this season. I do want to win the La Liga for the sixth time and the Champions League. But Cristiano Ronaldo here on the ball, breaking away, managed to get his header off. I did try to re-sign Ronaldo on a pre-contract, but uh, it just looks like it's not going to be. Thomas Muller there tearing up the right-hand side. Just couldn't manage to get through. Eden Hazard on the ball manages to find Suarez, who scored in the last match. But Lukaku manages to find James Rodriguez. And look how much space he gave Messi here. Messi hitting across the face. The former Barcelona player scores just before the 36th minute with a backflip and makes it 1-0 against Barcelona. I have no idea who that guy is. He looks like an absolute corker of a player. But Messi hits it with his right foot across the face. But Eden has it there. Look at this ball to Chicharito. Manages to break away. And I don't know if that should have been a penalty. It was, it was a close one. I'm not going to lie. But breaking away on the counter-attack here. Romelu Lukaku waiting for Javier to break away. And Javier Hernandez puts it into the bottom right. The 91 overall Mexican beast. Guys, but uh, obviously with the... Well, I feel like Barcelona's on the decline quite heavily. Um, they've just got all these like really weird sort of players. <laughs> like I don't know who they are. They've obviously come through their youth academy. But Cristiano Ronaldo is still in their side. Obviously, he was homesick and he decided to leave for Barcelona a, a fair few seasons ago. But uh, disappointing to see him celebrate like that and score. But uh, a really nice finesse here from Neymar from the kickoff trying to get something back here. But Mandaron on the ball trying to score his... 
um, goal, his first goal for Real Madrid. He gets his shot off, the 98 shot power at Bravo. He just couldn't seem to stick it into the back of the net. Matt Hummels with the header, falls short to Eden Hazard with the one pivot shot. I'm surprised he actually got that much power onto it. Crazy. Neymar on the ball, manages to find Rodriguez, and then manages to find Thomas Muller. We stretched the Barcelona defense way too quick, and uh, it actually resulted in being offside, which is disappointing. But hey, what are you going to do? I'm going to end the episode here, however. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Ben Simpsey. Remember to leave a like and goodbye.